And now. And Maloney goes up early, but Oakley gets it down. Might do his own roving. We go oh, through from half back. Clinton Shaw gets it towards centre half forward. Malone Grant over his head. Andrews through the middle. Aitchison against him, not giving him any room. Roberts kick off the ground. Falls towards Highland. Goes outboard now with the kick wide towards centre wing. Clinton Shaw goes back there. So does Brent Hood. Van Ingen also close to the banjo line. Good shepherd. Clinton Shaw. Van Ingen chopped off though by Highland. He runs onto it as well. Also in there Dan O'Connell. Free kick for a hold. Not coming. Comes back to Nick Maharis on centre wing now. Right foot kick. You can see the breeze holding yeah, it up there down and the down the field. He was dumped after he got rid of the footy. So Brett Andon with the free kick in between wing and half foot on the outer side. Dean Oakley there on his own. <coughs> goes high and long towards 50. There is Dean Oakley. He goes up. He can't take the mark off. Hands Luke Forbes runs in 30 metres out and closing and has oh, missed. Oh, that one. One goal, three to Luke Forbes this afternoon. Would have been a quick start for Thompson. 3-7-25. They lead Bannockburn 1-2-8. Raiders bingo, second quarter scoreboard. A minute played. Would have oh, see, that, really, that really wasn't a hard shot, was it? No, no. He's in the clear. Got himself in the clear. So Nathan Lewis, again, kicks to himself and uh, runs clear. Kick the ball to the middle of the ground. Huge kick. Alistair Woods on the wing. Goes for the mark. Armstrong. Handball to Gardner. Handball across further to Nick Maharis. Now Thompson. Run the ball across the uh, field. Oh, oh, two Bannockburn players. No talk there between Van Ingen and Lewis. Allows Hood to come through between them. And, oh, well, the umpire's pinged uh, Hood for lying on top of the footy. And the free yeah. kick will go to Nathan Lewis. Back pocket for Bannockburn. Will kick long. And he does. It's gone to centre wing. Huge kick. In front there, Roberts. Can't take the mark. But uh, Malone Grant does well. Follows up. Gets the ball. Eludes a couple of tackles. Then gets the foot to uh, the football. But only as far as Andrew Aitchison. Too quick for Andrews on that occasion. And on halfback flank, Aitchison for Thompson. Takes the mark. Gee, the ball waves around in the wind. But uh, luck's a fortune because it waved into the arms of Christian Highland on centre wing. And takes the mark. Chips it low. Into the bruise. Over the head there of uh, all players. And it and runs onto the footy. Good body work. <laughs> Gets around on the left foot, kicks it towards the full forward position. Luck is a fortune. Bounces well for Thompson. Hood, nobody in the goal square. He's hooked it over his shoulder. It's rolling, rolling, rolling. But uh, Giles will get back there. No score. Gets the ball right out towards the boundary. Forbes comes in, puts some pressure on. The handball comes to uh, Broom. He kicks long to centre wing. At the back is Armstrong. Over the head there of all players. The ball running with the breeze. Andrews comes in hard. <laughs> I tell you what. Timmy Gardner, he rode the bump. Oh, oh that's uh, most that's unnecessary and uh, down the ground. <laughs> and oh, gee, I'm surprised there's nothing more than that. The free kick goes to uh, Riley, the uh, relayed free kick, and he kicks toward the boundary on centre wing. Ball still in play, comes back in board to uh, Gibbs. Gibbs over the top to Lewis. Lewis now in front of us, Timmy Gardner, still uh, not too good after that bit of a... Uh, an altercation off the ball, comes to Alistair Woods for Bannockburn, kicks towards the full forward position, Nalen comes out, can't take the mark. At the back of the uh, the pack, the ball has come to uh, Stein, he's, uh, well, Ryan grabs him, hasn't got the footy, and uh, I think the blood rule, he might nearly have to come off uh, Timmy Gardner, doesn't want to, and uh, tell you what, so what's that on video, he'd been a bit of bother, oh. wouldn't he? Goodness gracious me, he's right in front of our broadcast position. Boundary umpire puts the ball in the uh, field of play. Picked up there by Baxter. Off a step. Finds Dwayne Broom. Hooks it back into centre half forward. Oh, Malone Grant. Good He's position. <laughs> and uh, has taken the mark. 35 metres out. Directly in front. And the opportunity early in the second quarter to uh, bring Bannockburn a little bit closer to Thompson. So, uh, Malone Grant. Normally a good kick, Eric, but you've got to execute it properly in this breeze. You've got to get your head over the ball and make sure you uh, control it to the foot. Good test for the young man now as he moves in. Tom Malone Grant, 35 metres out, directly in front. Laid back yeah, on it, but it's gone right over the goal umpire's head. That's the uh, first goal of this quarter to Bannockburn, to Mal Tom Malone Grant. They've gone now on the victory trophy's first quarter, second quarter, oh, sorry, Raiders bingo, second quarter score with Bannockburn 2-2-14. They trail Thompson 3-7-25, five minutes gone. Yeah, well, that was a good goal, uh, actually. They got it down there and uh, they got into the hot spot and uh, uh, Tom was uh, fortunate enough to be there and uh, in the pack situation yeah, uh, was able to take good mark. It was great work off the ball then too by Clark. He held, held, the, held the pack back for uh, Malone Grant to get the run at the ball, so uh, he, he's had a big hand in that one. So back to the middle, opening goal of the second term. 
to Bannockburn. Oakley, Maloney, falls to the back of the pack, O'Connor. Can't take it with him, though. No. Numbers with Bannockburn. Clark to get a shepherd from Broom. Kicks it off the ground into Andrew's arms. Back to Clark. Runs inside 50. Peewee, the skipper, to go long for goal. He's missed Ooh, through for one behind. Good setup. So they go to 2 3 15, Bannockburn. They trail Thompson 3 7 25. Raiders bingo, second quarter scoreboard. Five and a half minutes played. Well, see, at the moment, Bannockburn dominating centre clearances, aren't yep, they? Yeah, sure. So from there, the kick in, it was uh, Marcus Forbes goes to uh, Jason Stein. Across the ground to Savali Armstrong on his own. Very defensive from Thompson on that occasion, right across the face of goal. <coughs> but Armstrong in possession, back pocket. Looking for uh, leads up a further afield. Dale Menzies leads uh, a long way down the ground. But Armstrong goes long. Kicked it outside 50, the win holding it up in front. Uh, Aitchison can't take the mark. O'Connor ducked his head. It's in a bit of bother. Roberts, handball there, picked up there by Broom, picked up by Hickleton. Hickleton there, long kick to full forward, up high nail. Ryan! Back of the oh. pack, Darren Ryan runs into the goal square, has kicked his second. And here comes Bannockburn with the breeze in this second quarter. Bannockburn, three goals, 3.21. They trailed Thompson, 3.7.25. Raiders bingo, second quarter scoreboard, six and a half minutes gone. They went around the pack, I know, they just uh, ran the clearances when the, and the stoppages, they're just getting the, the fellows in there and getting the ball moving, and that was, uh, uh, Darren was in the right spot at the right time and read the ball brilliantly, then uh, of course his pace just carries him through, no one's going to catch him once he uh, gets that uh, metre break on you. No, he crumbed beautifully there, and uh, that's the way to play this uh, windy conditions, get up into that spot, and uh, if there's a crumb there, uh, and you're fortunate to bounce on the right side of the pack, you're going to have most uh, times kick a goal from it. Probably Clarkie should have kicked a goal from his kick too, I think he had time to steady. So back to the middle, umpire Andrew for Oakley and Maloney. It's going to be Oakley to rack for Thompson towards the northern end. Maloney goes up, gets it down to the front of the pack. Lewis in there, gets it away again, under pressure towards half forward. Oh, oh Ellis great towards mark, great Ellison. mark. Outside 50, he's taking the mark in front of Chris Baxter. Some of these tools are causing a little bit of trouble yep. at the moment right now as well. He stood up in the last two weeks, this young fella. So Alistair Woods, outside 50 with the breeze. Comes in now, gives it everything he's got square. And Mullane Grant oh. goes up, can't take the mark. Flanagan at the front, loses the football, then drags it back in. Be careful. Umpire yeah. said dropping the footy. And will be a free kick to Thompson, Jason Stein. I think, I think he knew he was in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> Called the play on, dangerous oh. kick, terrible kick. Dwayne Broom, turnover, has taken the mark. Nathan Lewis says go for goal. He's only 40 metres out, and he's a left footer. And it'll be a tough kick, just kicking across the breeze. And he will shoot for goal. This to give Bannockburn the lead for the first time. See, this is this is one of my uh, bones of contention. I don't know why Alistair Woods has got to go in there. You go in there, you take your man in there. I can't. That doesn't root. Well done. Darren Rice kicked his third, and that's given Bannockburn the lead for the first time in the game. Four goals, 4-28. They lead Thompson 3-7-25. Raiders bingo. Second quarter scoreboard, 10 minutes gone. Just ran that stoppage again, um, Laurie, they, they're just um, taking it away and they bottled Thompson up over there. They had four or five kicks and only went probably 30 or 40 metres and then they just brought it back with one big kick down the centre and uh, Darren, using all his experience, got in the right place at the right time again. Yeah, exactly right, in the right spot where it's going to be, not where it ain't. Good shepherd so, from the umpire helped him. Back to the middle, Maloney got it down this time to Highland, to O'Connor, goes towards centre half, Ford, Forbes comes out. Keeps it in front of him. Against him is Dylan. Keeps his feet. Now coming in. Mitchell as well on the ground. Kick around the corner towards half forward. Hood puts on a tackle. Does well. Then taps it on. Back towards the corridor. Menzies on the ground as well. Kick off the ground past Anderton. Foot race getting across there is Damian Clark. Gets a shepherd from Van Ingen. From uh, defensive 50. Goes towards centre wing. Nick Maharis against Dwayne Broom. Coming back towards Clark. Has to get around a couple. Got rid of the footy. Flanagan. Al right. Pushing the backs of the umpire. Clarky. And Damien Clark will take the free kick at half back for Bannockburn. He's doing okay. So Damien Clark chips the ball over the top. It's okay too. Finds Christian Shaw on centre wing. Drives it long towards centre half. We'll do the win take that. 65 oh. metre kick to Nathan Lewis. Put a hand up. Couldn't take it with him. Roberts wrapped up. Needs to get it away. O'Connor under pressure. Flanagan. The numbers there. Oh, oh too high. Oh, oh held to him. What's going on? And a ball up 50 metres out from the Bannockburn goal. So, big pack around it now. 
Oakley to do the ruck work against Andrews. Oakley gets it down towards Armstrong, wrapped up, gives it away to Highland. Highland in pressure, under uh, under pressure to Aitchison. Now Hickledon, only as far as Christian Highland from half back, wobbly kick towards centre wing. Menzies, oh. that's a push in the back. Three kick centre wing, and Thompson to take it. Through Dale Menzies, not much to kick to. Savali Armstrong murdering himself to go to centre half forward. He's never going to kick it that far. He chips the ball over the top to Christian Holland, who ran on. And on. Back towards Troy Maharas. Bannockburn under pressure. Oh, Get it towards Lewis, but it bounces for Oakley. Gets around a couple. Gives it to Shane Stone. The coach can dribble it towards Armstrong. He gets around on his left. 40 metres out with the breeze. Oh, goal! Oh, Somali Armstrong oh. has put it through for a great goal to Thompson and gives them the lead again. 4-7-31. They take the lead again. Bannockburn, 4-4-28. Raiders bingo, second quarter scoreboard, 12 and a half minutes played. Well, that's the goal you look for, you know. It's against the tide. Bannockburn have, have played uh, played all over Thompson for the last uh, seven or eight minutes, and then that, just that goal against the tide sort of gets them going. And, uh, yeah, that was well done. They set that up pretty well. Well, it was a good play by Sabali Armstrong. He set himself up for that. He ran yep. a long way to get up into that uh, forward zone, and uh, he hung around up there, and... Uh, that, that's uh, footy smarts at, at, at its best. Gardner's come back on, looks like the elephant man. Yeah. <laughs> Bandages all on his face. So in the middle, ball goes up once again. Tap down by Maloney to Lewis for Bannockburn. Lewis, huge kick straight into the, the back, full forward the position. Back. At the back of the pack, Ryan runs with Stein. And unfortunately, the ball has uh, eluded both of them over the boundary line. So uh, the ball uh, waiting on the boundary up moved so quickly the boundary umpire was 70 or 80 metres behind <laughs> on that occasion and a huge kick there from uh, Nathan Lewis. So the ball now, forward pocket for Thompson, comes into play. In front there, Aitchison does the ruck work, Woods crumbed well, Baxter looking for the boundary of the handball, tries to uh, kick it along the boundary line, yes I thought <laughs> Umpire it's the right umpire. Yeah. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> He's been pretty subdued today, hasn't he? <laughs> yes. So far. Yeah. So the ball 30 metres now from the behind post, about to come in once again. In ruck there, Aitchison, big tap forward. In the way there, Christian Highland tries to elude the tackle. Gets a handball to Baxter, handball to Maharas, handball to Aitchison. Now Thompson, they've done well, they've got it out of the danger area. Long kick to uh, Dean oh. Oakley on centre wing. Mark has been paid. And uh, ball now. Relayed back to Dean Oakley. Big mark on centre wing. Who said you can't take marks and don't like today, Laurie? That That's was right. huge. So Dean Oakley when now. You got that talent, you can. Looking for options. Decides to go short. He's got uh, Nick Maharis on centre wing. He now kicks long along the boundary line. Good goal. Good mark. Huge mark there from uh, Chris, uh, Clinton Shaw on halfback flank for Bannockburn. Should go long. Decides now to do that. Kicks it uh, well over the centre. Big pack of players there. Aitchison missed at the back of the pack. Oh, Lewis, Lewis. crashed through the, uh, oh, the tackle there. Lewis. Unfortunately, went without the footy. Baxter, he tries to uh, butter up there, but Woods does well. Calm in the situation. Beautiful pass. Nolan, unfortunately, can't take the mark. Come to Forbes. Nice handball over to Roberts. He's chipped it over the top. Stone pushed out there by Flanagan. Got uh, Carr loose in the middle. Chips it back in that direction. Oh. Over his head, Roberts does well, but he's only punched it straight in the arms there of Gibbs. Uh, David Gibbs. Gibbs now, runs clear, has plenty of time towards half forward. Andrews can't take the mark from behind. Uh, good work in buttering up there, Ryan. Oh, Ryan, the danger man, picked it up. He's dodged about four or five. Handball over the top to Dwayne Broom. Can't get the footy. Stein, he tries to clear it. Only as far as Mullane Grant grabs it, hooks it around the body. But there, on his own in the goal square, is Baxter for Thompson. Chips it wide and uh, has found Nick Mahara. So, Lewis, oh, gee. Most no, he was playing on, don't worry about that. But most important <laughs> to give 50 for that. However, Highland picks it up on half-back. Handball, long, over the top. Has found Roberts, chips it in board. Has found O'Connor. O'Connor was going as well, I think, but suddenly found a uh, Bannockburn opponent in front of him. Chips it forward. Stone takes the mark. They're still only between wing and half-forward out of side, the uh, Thompson side, but they've got possession. Anderton, long lead from uh, half forward, but they need uh, someone to kick it to. Highland runs along the boundary line very quietly, kicks it low to the lead there of uh, Dean Oakley. Tacks the ball well, handball comes back to Highland, chips it over the top looking for Stone. Play on to the umpire, no mark. Ball comes in board to uh, Van Ingen. Van Ingen for uh, Bannockburn towards centre half forward, bounced off Andrew's chest at the back. Baxter, handball over the top to Nick Maharis. 
gets around on the right foot, but handballs instead. Oh, Noel Riley. Oh. Well, off you on play. Cameron Carr. So there's uh, a relayed free kick once again, and uh, unfortunately, Bannockburn. Uh, so the free kick has in fact gone to John Mitchell. Sees uh, Sabali Armstrong run loose to half forward, takes the mark, and. Uh, You'd suggest these behind the scene incidents are going to pay before the day's over against them, don't you? Yeah. So Sabali Armstrong now decides to kick in board. And he's got all Thompson players back in the corridor. That's where it needs to go. And uh, Nick Maharis has taken a mark. Chips it in board. Oh, strong lead from brother Troy. Strong mark on his chest. Gets up high. And uh, Thompson just playing possession football at the moment. Seven and a half minutes gone in the second quarter. They're looking for options, they're waiting for the right option, and then their foot passing has been very good in this uh, middle part of the second quarter. You kick it long. Troy kick Maharis long, yeah. now, all these options are gone, he's going to have to kick it long, he's going to have to get on with it pretty oh. soon. Why you would go out there, I'll never know, but he's kept possession. Baxter, taking the mark, he's tipped it to the lead there of Forbes. Oh, that's a free kick, surely. But uh, play on to the umpire, picked up by Riley, hooks it back into the goal square. Big pack of players up there. The punch comes clear for Thompson. Forbes. Luke Forbes, he's hooked it across his body. He's got Savali Armstrong over there. Hood, front and centre once again on the left foot. Oh! oh! <laughs> Shane Stone. I reckon he was having a shot at goal on the <laughs> he left was. foot. He's kicked it straight into the arms of Shane Stone. Ten metres directly in front of goal. Well, you get a game next week. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, great work, Thompson. They waited their options. They took their time. And uh, the opportunity now for the coach to uh, reward the good work. And he's well, done mate. just that. Shane Stone has kicked the goal. A very important goal for the Thompson team in this second quarter. Thompson, 5-7-37. They lead Bannockburn, 4-4-28. Raiders bingo, second quarter scoreboard. 19 minutes goal. Well, that was a great goal. Yeah. Great goal into the breeze. And... Uh, Look, I've got to just make a comment. You can be stupid off the ball, but when it's your turn to be hard and face up, to be hard. And I won't yeah. mention any names. For sure. You've got to stand up. Have a go. Not behind play when you've got the ball in front of you. <laughs> Murray had those angry pills at the grand final breakfast this morning, <laughs> no, I think. No, 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 no he's fired up. He had the opportunity to get the ball in, and he didn't get it. I won't tell you his name. I'll just tell you his number. Back in the middle, 48 goes now through a Highland, gives it to O'Connor, off a step towards half forward. Mitchell, Carr. Mitchell goes up, off hands, Armstrong. Carr, there he is, ducks his head, got a free kick. So at the point of the centre square at half back, Cameron Carr to relieve the pressure for Banning Burn. Goes now with the right foot towards half forward. Perkins on a long lead. Riley against him. Front and centre was Flanagan. Keeps it in front of him. Now Oakley comes across. Clark's there. Gardner against him. Hustles him towards the boundary. And you wouldn't get too hard a bloke to the footy, would you? Than Damien Clark and Tim Gardner. And they see each other over the boundary line and the footy for a throw in. So Perkins up against Oakley in the ruck contest. Perkins, Oakley gets it down with the left fist towards Woods, used the body, now through the middle, Baxter did well, breaks free, goes with a right foot kick, holds up in the breeze, Mitchell stands in front of Gibbs, takes the mark, that's where you have to be. Yeah, John Mitchell, lead on from Forbes, Armstrong against Broom, Peacock on the ground replacing Anderlin, goes there now, falls in front though, Aaron Broom takes Why the mark. Why would you go there, said Welshy. Handball away towards Matty Dilling running across half back. Holds up in the breeze towards Nick Maharis in front. Good mark. Good strong mark against Cameron Carr. And in the centre square, he's taken the grab. So now Nick Maharis switches play to Christian Highland. Must have a disease this quarter, I think, Christian Highland. Thought about handballing it away to O'Connor. Then he gets around Malane Grant, goes long towards the leader, Luke Forbes. Troy oh, Maharis. Oh, Luke right Forbes. Right. Used the body beautifully. He read that well. He's pretty strong for a smaller yeah, player, isn't he, Welshie? Yeah. And he puts himself in the right spot too. He, he seems to know, be able to read the ball. And that, that is a skill in football, to be able to read it where it's going to drop. And you can see him there. He held the player off with one arm, as Eric called it. Good use of the body. And just pulled it in with his skill with the, uh, with the right arm. So here. Luke Forbes has kicked one goal, three. If he goes out to the left here, he'll nearly be in the car park. And he <laughs> does go out to the left. He'll be kicking it low into the breeze. Oh, and he's hit the post. Right. So one goal, four to Luke Forbes. And they go to five, eight, 38, Thompson. Bannockburn, four, four, 28. Raiders, bingo, second quarter scoreboard, 21 and a half minutes played. So Nathan Lewis and uh, now Thompson 
trying to put the stopper on that running off yeah. because Dan O'Connor 15 metres out as it allowed to be oh, in the middle right. of the ground. Dean Oakley went high, didn't take the mark. Malone Grant well tackled. The ball's come to ground. Pushed out there by uh, Flanagan. Van Ingen can't control it. Picked up by Roberts. Great smother. Picked up by Flanagan for Bannockburn. Kicks to the middle of the ground. At the back, Baxter. Nice uh, spoil from behind. Perkins. Does well. Oh, Baxter threw it to uh, Gibbs. Gibbs, that's his opposition. He's having trouble picking it up, David. Gibbs, handball over the top. He's got Perkins clear. <coughs> Perkins now. Kicks that, long to full forward. That's a kick. One on one there. Forbes and Nolan. Ball comes to ground. Darren Ryan picks it up. Well tackled. Goal. Eludes the tackle. Goal. Running into an open goal. And he's has fourth. kicked his fourth. So, great work by the coach. Did well with the body. Bennington, 5 4 34. Thompson, 5 8 38. Raiders bingo, second quarter scoreboard, 22 and a half, and it's gone. Shades of the Belmont Lions. <laughs> yeah. And he kicked nine. Still well down there, and he's just getting his in the right spot. And, well, uh, when, he was, when he was chasing around that ball, it was only a matter of he's going to get his uh, footing and uh, yeah. get clear and uh, exactly what he did. And uh, he knows he's uh, he knows his trade. Well, she doesn't know about that. I bet you the runner goes straight to Jason Stein, who's yeah. on Darren Ryan. Why wouldn't you? <laughs> well, I bet you Noel Riley goes back on him. I think, well, I, I think, think they're going to make someone else on there, yeah, that's for sure. But Sonny's a, uh, just a little bit loose at times, too. He, um, he's good to set things up out the back, but he can be a little bit loose. I should coach a team. Back to the middle. Riley's going back on Ryan. Maloney gets it down. Lewis taps it on towards centre half forward. Clark runs through the middle, breaks a couple of tackles, then loses the football. Goes towards Broom. Armstrong against him. There's Lewis again. Kick off the ground towards Ryan. In front of Stein again. 50 out. Kicks around the corner towards the goal square. Nalen to run back onto it. Oh, which way is it going to bounce into Forbes' arms? And he runs away from Nalen at, at the fullback. Goes oh. towards, well, outside 50, but Malone Grant takes the easy mark. God, he was right going for Troy Maharis, but uh, direction wasn't too brilliant. Tom tried to grab a metre there too. <laughs> so Malone Grant will shoot from 55 metres out with the breeze. He'll be uh, close to it. <clears throat> He's hit one goal this afternoon. So Tom Malone Grant. Comes in, gives it everything he's got, and with that he's missed it to the near side, uh, to the far side, sorry, and through for one behind. Thompson will be looking to hold them up here. They want not to concede another goal and <laughs> just go in that little bit in front at uh, half time. So they go to 5 5 35. They trail Thompson 5 8 38. So uh, Armstrong, the quick kick in, found Highland. He's chipped it further forward to Nick Maharis, who's run from the wing to uh, take the mark on half-back flank ahead of Christian Shaw. So uh, Thompson, as well she's indicated, looking for the possession game. We're getting very, very close to time on in the second quarter. Decides to chip it low. Terrible, oh, terrible oh, kick. Nick. So if you're going to kick, the, play that sort of game, your skills have got to be perfect. Out of bounds on the full. Tom Malone Grant on centre wing out of side. Has the free kick, plays on, kicks it in board. Big pack of players at centre half back. Ball comes to the front of the pack. Picked up by uh, Clark. Tries to uh, get clear. Gets a handball to Lewis. Lewis off a oh. step around the body. It's going to land almost in the goal square. But back there is Christian Highland. Takes the mark. Decides to play on ahead of Hincliffe now. His kick. Well, oh. they're throwing it away, Thompson, at the moment with very poor skills. And uh, all of a sudden, Ben Nolan has found a a fair yard of speed because I don't know what No, no, down team. the field, free kick. Down the field, was it? Oh, yeah. I beg your pardon. Got dumped after he got rid of the footy, Christian Highland. Well, luck is a fortune because uh, maybe that's no, caused the ball to skew out of bounds. Oh, or is it? Yeah. yeah. So, Nolan going back thinking he's having a shot for goal. So, uh, a number of players not too sure what's happening, but the free, has, free kick relayed down the ground has gone to Marcus Forbes off Thompson. Nolan now standing the mark. So, Forbes now, long kick. Towards centre wing, wind holding it, oh, up high. Gee, the man in front, Alistair Woods, took on the tools and has taken the mark in front of the pack. So Woods now, Paul Bannockburn, he's uh, 70 metres from goal, <coughs> should go back into the corridor, surely. He's done just that, kicked it to uh, two centre half forward. Oh, oh, good mark. In the pack, Ben Nolan, as he did last week. Some big, strong pack marks up forward. And he's taken the mark 35 metres out, directly in front. The opportunity to uh, put Bannockburn in front, very close to half-time. He hasn't kicked one yet either, Eric. No, he hasn't. He hasn't had a lot of the footy up there, actually. But um, this is the important kick for uh, Bannockburn. 
I think distance is uh, absolutely not a problem. There's Ben Nail in there. Moves in. Marcus Forbes on the mark. 30 metres out. It's a lovely looking lovely kick from Ben Nail. I don't think the goal umpire's got any problem whatsoever with that one. First goal of the day to Ben Nolan and gives the lead to the Bannockburn side. 6 5 41. Lead Thompson 5 8 38. Raiders bingo. Second quarter scoreboard. 27 minutes gone. Yeah, that's a great mark in the pack, wasn't it? Just um, when, when it is uh, blustery and that, that just hit his hands and stuck. And uh, coming out in front, he's a big, strong lad, and uh, they'll be looking at more of that uh, coming out the ground. Well, Forbes has had his hands full, even though Nolan hasn't had much of the footy. Yep. He's really had some trouble uh, containing him. It's actually a good matchup, though. I mean, Forbes is the man to go with him. There. Oh, There's no, no doubt about else. that, and they've got no one else up there. <laughs> but uh, it was a lovely kick as well, wasn't it? Yeah. Uh, copybook stuff. Back to the middle. Oakley and Andrews. Andrews goes up early. Oakley gets it down towards Highland. Breaks free. Goes towards half forward. Over the head of Van Ingen. Running onto it, Aaron Broom. Runs away from Stone. And goes with the right boot towards half forward. Lewis to make up a lot of ground on the footy. Does so now. Can he keep it in? Yes, he can. Runs in front of O'Connor, left foot kick back towards Nailin. Oh, Ryan, third in line, can't take the mark off hands. Through the middle, Nailin at the front, Tom Mullane, Grant over the top of it as well. Tried to get rid of it, he did, over his shoulder for a goal. Oh, you're kidding me. Tom you're Mullane, like Grant has put his second on the board. And a crucial goal to Bannockburn, close to half time. His second is Bannockburn's seventh. They go to 7-5, 47. They lead Thompson, 5-8, 38-8. Raiders bingo, second quarter scoreboard, 28 minutes played. Well, that was a yeah, sensational goal, wasn't it? Boy, I'll tell you what, he's going to be a good player, this kid, when he learns to get some skills. <laughs> <laughs> he's sensational. <laughs> Isn't that the coach talking? He'd <laughs> uh, be drafted the way Laurie's going. <laughs> How about that? So back in the middle now. 28 and a half minutes gone, second quarter. Benny Byrne. They've got the nose in front as the ball goes in the air once again. Dean Oakley, huge tap down for Thompson. Goes toward Peacock on the ground. Handball back to Nick Maharis. He's in oh, trouble. in trouble, Nick. Does get the foot to the ball, but uh, handball there comes to uh, Christian Shaw. Has one bounce, has a second bounce. Has almost run to 50. Kicks it long. It's a long kick to the head of the goal square in front. Perkins can't take the mark. Ball comes to ground, front of the pack. Darren Ryan's there. Can he get hold of the footy? He can't. The Thompson defence smother it up. And uh, 15 metres out, directly in front, the umpire will put the ball into the air once again. Another goal here, well, she would be very dangerous yes, for Thompson. for sure. And they'll be looking to knock this out of bounds. So the ball now, Roberts, big punch away, dead right, looking for the boundary. Picked up there by uh, Hintcliffe. Handball long to uh, Christian Shaw. Right foot up. Highland did well, kept him on the uh, wrong foot. The punch comes there from Riley. Oh, Forbes took it into the goal square. And uh, finally, it is Baxter. Just chips it, retain Hold possession, and uh, Nick Maharis has taken the mark in back pocket. So Thompson now just uh, trying to uh, quieten down, keep possession before half time. Chips it over the top. Roberts takes the mark. Just ahead there of uh, Corey Flanagan. So Brad Roberts now, still inside defensive 50, deep on the, uh, the boundary line. For Thompson, won't need to kick it too wide. The wind will uh, certainly get hold of it. Decides to go long. It's a good looking kick. Inside the field of play. In front, Peacock. Can't take the mark. Ball comes to the front of the pack. Gibbs can't pick it up for Bannockburn. Kick along the ground. Ball uh, finally comes to uh, Shane Stone for Thompson. Kicks it towards half forward. Hood outrun on that occasion by Van Ingen. Quick kick towards the half forward line. It's still in play. Malone Grant. Gets the footy, he's inside 50, kicks to the... Uh, oh, that's another remarkable goal. Tom Malone Grant from the 50 metre line, bounced in the goal square, through the goals. His third goal for the quarter. And seventh kick for the quarter, so and, that, yeah. that tells you something. So Bannockburn, 8-5, 53. Lead Thompson, 5-8, Raiders bingo. Second quarter scoreboard, 31 minutes gone. <laughs> well, so is where they are, and he just picked it up then, summed up the situation. Do you know uh, if he's got a manager? <laughs> <laughs> he is now. Laurie D. De Goldie. <laughs> oh man, that was a sensational goal, wasn't it? The other one was a ripper, but it was just equally as good. So back to the middle. Come on, another quick one here, boys. Oh, you to win. <laughs> While you're hot. Seven goal quarter for Bannockburn. Andrews and Oakley. Andrews gets it down towards O'Connor. 
Breaks free, handball to Jason Stein off a step under pressure. Lux of Fortune to Stone, gives it away to O'Connor again. Lewis, I think, down at, yeah. no, is it Lewis in the yes. middle? Yeah. Down. Yep. Now towards half forward, Peacock over the top of it. Handballs it back to Highland, going to be under pressure from Christian Shaw. Gets a kick away towards the uh, 10 metre square, coming at it, Troy oh. Maharis as the siren sounds Lucky. for half time. And at half time, it's Bannockburn 8 5 53. They lead Thompson 5 8 38 in that second term. Thompson, uh, Bannockburn managed seven goals, three. And Thompson managed two goals, two. 15 points of difference at half time. Goal kickers right. for Bannockburn, four to Darren Ryan, three to Tom Mullane Grant, and a single goal to Ben Nail and Walford Thompson. At singles to Sabali Armstrong, Shane Stone, Luke Forbes, Brett Anderton, and Brent Hood. Still down, Lewis. 15 yeah. points of difference at th at half time. Bannockburn with the lead. we take a break. When we come back, we'll have the second half action in the 2003 GDFL Grand Final on 94.7 The Pulse, your home of local football.